it's Christy and I have a shoe box that I just filled for a boy 10 to 14. I'm going to be making a lot of these older boy shoe boxes. I have a big bowl of little gens that I can keep pulling out to fill in the gaps because I keep hearing in my mind's eye Franklin Graham and he always says send more toys. So that is really what happened with this shoe box. Lots of great toys in here. I was so glad I had them on hand. It is a very full and wonderful box for a 10 to 14 year old boy. So right on top, you'll see I have the full size uh, spiral notebook right here sticking up on this and it just kind of folds over with the lid. And I have my disclaimer that I'm sending um, in the top of my boxes that says that there are no things that Operation Christmas Child doesn't allow. Hopefully that will help the person that is inspecting the box and they'll realize that I don't have any pocket knives or anything that shouldn't be allowed. And otherwise they're going to really have a hard time putting everything back. So I'm really hoping that these disclaimers that we've included before will help the people at the processing center. So if you want any printables printed out that I mentioned, go to blessingsinissuebox.com and you can print them out for yourself. But this is one of them that I have included in my shoe box. And inside my spiral notebook, I have other printables, but I'll get to those. So this is what it looks like, nice and full. You can see there's a soccer ball in here. And there's also this really cute plush dinosaur. I will um, start pulling everything out here and show you what I've got. This is a fishing kit inside. It has the fishing line and some lures and hooks. It's just really doesn't waste any space. Everything is packed perfectly in here. Um, here's the, well, I don't even want to take it all out because it's fitting so perfectly, but I love how Michelle put these together. Michelle is my friend that runs the website. Um, she also does, she does all the printables on there. Go to the printable page if you want coloring books or there's so many things on there. I urge you to check it out, blessingsinashoebox.com. And she also runs the Facebook group. That is a, such a wonderful site to land on. Blessings in Issue Box Facebook group has, she finds lots of deals so that we can get, really stretch our budget when we're trying to buy things for our shoe boxes. So check out both of those resources. They're invaluable. So here's the fishing kit. Here's his plush. And here is a crank flashlight. And I printed out from blessingsinashoebox.com, I printed out the directions on how to use this pump flashlight. And I just kept it in the bubble wrap so that it would stay protected. And then I bet you can't guess what this is. This is a pair of sunglasses. And I put it in these pockets that Michelle made for me. I don't know if you saw my last video, but I think these are so cool and a boy will love them and they're all use, um, UVC protected. So those are in here and I love the little case. It just keeps it from being scratched. And then I guess I'll get the water bottle out next. I um, have gotten some of these water bottles from Walmart and I'm able to put a a lot of my things inside the water bottle. Don't send air when you're packing your shoe boxes. You wanna make sure even your water bottles are filled to the brim with useful things for a child. All right, so here is a fun whistle. I do have a soccer ball in here, so I thought that would be fun with all my soccer balls to send a whistle on a string. This is the prayer pocket that Michelle made. She sent these to me. Each one's different, has a little cross on there if you can see it, and then it has a pocket prayer behind. And it says, this prayer pocket was made especially for you to keep in your pocket, carry it with you as a reminder that you are always surrounded by God's love. I love you and I'm praying for you. So it's a special little gem. Hopefully the child will understand 
that the person that sent this shoebox is praying for them and they can just keep it in their pocket as a reminder. Um, there's a lot of other things in here. There are some zip ties. I think there's five altogether. Yep, zip ties. And let me get everything out. There is, what is this? Let me make sure before I say it. Oh yeah, this is the ball pump and it really fills up. This is the Friendly Swede brand and it's really nice and small and I have extra needles in here. It has three needles and I just splurged when they were on sale. The Friendly Swede ones were on sale because I like having the extra room because the pump is so nice and small and it's good quality too. There is a tiny little mending kit and there are lots of little school supply things in here. Oh, let's see, we've got a toothbrush with a cover. We've got a multi-pen. I love including those, the red, green, black, and blue. And then I have a couple of dinosaurs in here for him. Uh, here's a pen, the pencils more pens and pencils. I also have pencil sharpeners, this cool matchbox car, some, oh, a hygiene kit in here with nail clippers, the directions on how to use the nail clippers and nail file. That is on blessingsinissuebox.com too. The printable for that has little nail files in there. Here's this other dinosaur and some more sharpeners and eraser caps. And oh, I love these um, different pencil sharpeners. That's a jet. I love how they come in the different shapes. And the rest is pencil cap erasers and pencils that are already sharpened. It makes it so much easier for the child if they can have their pencils already sharpened. Here is a little kit to make a friendship bracelet with the directions in multiple languages. I want to say it's at least eight languages. It's nice, nicely folds up into a baggie with uh, the different colored threads there. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten languages. And then it has the visual instructions. So I'm really glad to be able to send that. I think it's fun to encourage the children to do uh, crafts. They probably, that's not something that they normally do at home. And then here's some deck of cards for them. And well, here's the soccer ball. I'm pretty sure this year I got all size four. I'll take off the rubber band and see, because I have, inside the soccer ball a pair of underwear from old navy and this cool soccer t-shirt i bought bought a lot of those when they were on sale um online on amazon they're from children's place but they were selling them on amazon so i roll those up that's part of the instructions when you're sending the soccer ball and we send the instructions in there. It tells them not to, um, well, not we know not to make this so tight. And then when they take the, the shirt out, they'll be able to pump it up. But they need to pump it up a certain way so that it doesn't hurt the bladder. So that those instructions are uh, in here someplace in my tie a knot. Here they are inflating the soccer ball instructions. You can also print those out on blessingsinissuebox.com. So many different languages here. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twenty 10, 20 different languages. I think that's awesome that she's able to do that. And then what else is in here? Uh, some cool stickers, peanuts. I think the kids, um, since they get a plain notebook, they can decorate their notebook or something else with their stickers, make it personal. This is how to tie a fishing knot. So all the directions and the visuals are on here. And again, multiple languages. 
how to tie a knot. These are great sets. I have um, it's twine in here for them to use, and then it shows step by step how to make the knot. Um, I have this measuring tape, carabiner measuring tape. I get those from uh, Harbor Freight, and they are really nice quality, and they go 10 feet, and they can fit on a backpack. Um, which I have included in here. And this is a little magnifying glass and it had, you press the button and it lights up. I don't know if you can see that. I have one little, um, what are these called? Are these called carabiners too? These carabiners are able to hold something down. I think that's just a fun thing to send along. They might find some use for it. Some heart that's a very soft and it also can hold, go on a backpack. It's got a little clip on it. Here's the scissors, and this is a special marble maze that Michelle made. It's really soothing to just push that marble through the maze of the stitching, and even the back is cute with the corners. This is one of my favorite things to send. Very special homemade, and I love doing the marble maze myself. So that is a nice thing to include. This is his coloring book. I had to decide which coloring book because Michelle has a lot of coloring books on blessingsandissuebox.com. I decided to go with the one that had a lot of soccer pictures inside. I also printed out the dinosaur one and I was going back, back and forth because that one's cool too. So check out the coloring books. They're nice and flat to be able to include, but yet there's a lot of pictures in there. Um, here is this backpack, I have it all rolled up. It's a nice canvas material. I really like these backpacks. I got them really early in the year um, for a good price. I can't remember, but I did get them on Amazon. And then here's another fun toy. It's also educational. It's the Tangram. I made those a while ago. I just loved making them and it has all the pieces in here. They can make all these different, a house, a rabbit, a bear. It's a really good for a mind, your mind to um, make those different designs. It's great for children. And then um, I have this washcloth, almost done. I have my pencil pouch. I left the colored uh, pencils in there. It's a set of 12. And then I have the big erasers in here. And then I have another, I printed out this um, cover from blessingsandissuebox.com and then I left inside of it has all blank paper and I love on the back that it said says um, God loves you in all those different languages and then there's also a, some kind of a special pencil in here that's a triangular shape and a big eraser and here is the bandana, I like to send a bandana in all of my shoe boxes. And this is his 12 inch ruler. I put that on a diagonal on the bottom. And let's see if there's anything else in the spiral notebook, just to be sure. Yep, that's it. It's full size spiral, spiral notebook with 70 sheets. So that brings us to the end. I'm not sure how many toys were included, but there are a lot of toys and useful um, fun items to include in a shoebox. So uh, thank you for watching. This is my first 10 to 14 box this year and I was really happy with it. I just love the idea of the child receiving the shoebox and the great joy that they will get from something special that they really delight in and that will turn their heart toward Jesus and wanting Jesus to be their savior. That's the goal, this is why we're doing that, and I hope that you'll continue to come back. Subscribe if you haven't already, because I'm gonna be coming up with a lot more videos um, soon. So thank you for watching, God bless you, and bye for now.